to the vlog. Oh my god, this is the first vlog on my channel. This is crazy. Welcome. Glad you stopped by. Uh, yeah, so my name is Jasmine. Welcome to Jasmine's Journal. You know, I'm just here vlogging. I'm here just, you know, hauling. I'm here eating. Just whatever. All lifestyle. Everything lifestyle and in between. So yeah, I am about to head to the gym. Get a little workout in. Okay guys, so we're off to the gym. A kind of a late workout. But we're still going. Um, yeah. So, ooh, and now, ooh, this is in the way. My mailbox is like wide open. Let me go get that mail. I'm back. Okay, my mailbox was like wide open and I didn't want the mail to fall out. I don't know, I just, I just got the mail, okay? It's not that serious. Anyways, um, this is my first vlog first driving vlog i'm not really like looking at the camera so i hope you don't get triggered by that but i am trying to be an alert driver i don't like what do people even do in these vlogs i'm really trying to like get into this vlogger lifestyle you know got a real diy setup here it's kind of hilarious and i hope this is like not crooked the entire time I feel like it is gonna be. Okay. Okay, we got a little something loading here. Anyways, today I did a closet declutter. I recorded it all, so that should be in a video I don't know if I'm gonna do this first or that first. I mean, clearly you'll see um, if that's up before this video. But anyways, I did a closet declutter, honey, and let me tell you, I decluttered a lot of clothes. I was just feeling that I had so many clothes in my closet and nothing to wear. So I was like, you know what? Let me go through, let me reevaluate what I have. Like, what am I wearing? What am I not wearing? Oh, the police, oh my God, the police are coming so fast. And they're not, they don't have any like sirens on. That was really weird. I was like, let me reevaluate what I have, what I'm wearing, what I'm not wearing, what sparks joy when I touch it, feel it, see it. Because that's what uh, Marie Kondo, she said that, and I watched all of her show on Netflix. And that's what she says you're supposed to have joy sparked within you when you see a piece of clothing. So, I touched it, I felt them, and I just kept the ones that spark joy, like she said. Um, anyways, I am very proud of myself for getting rid of the clothing that I did. I'm definitely challenging myself not to purchase any new clothing this upcoming month, um, because our girl needs to save her dollars, okay? I gotta save my coins, I cannot keep spending money on clothes that I don't wear so I'm challenging myself to only wear what I have in my closet not to go out and purchase anything new I will have oh it's crooked again oh god oh sorry y'all my neighborhood is the worst to get out of sorry this is like such a tangent but my neighborhood is the worst to get out of and I've been sitting here for literally like three minutes and I'm ready to like get out and there's so many cars anyways going back to the clothing I just didn't realize I mean I kind of did realize that I had a lot of stuff but at the same time I'm just like okay I'm not wearing this stuff why I have it in here and I'm not wearing it I'm not feeling inspired so I rearranged some stuff I kind of reorganized it so that when I go into my closet I feel inspired I feel oh I don't want to sound like cliche like oh my god I'm not oh oh this is getting a little rocky oh my god okay sorry oh Oh, no. oh, that's like my favorite meme right now. So please don't judge me. Anyways, I just want to feel inspired when I go in my closet. I truly do enjoy fashion. So I want to like the clothes that I have. I mean, duh. I mean, I should. I bought them. But um, 
Yeah, oh, it's gonna get a little bumpy. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, just give me one little second so I can pull over and adjust my frame because this is unacceptable. Okay, I'm pulled over. I'm not driving, okay? Okay, y'all, I'm trying to do this whole YouTube thing without investing any money, so I am literally... Oh, it's a little dirty. Oh my goodness, this is going out horribly. Who's gonna watch this? I don't know. Anyways, um, <laughs> I am trying to do this YouTube thing for no money, but I think I'm gonna have to invest in a $7 tripod that's made for the to let for know. Because this is just not a good look. Okay. Oh my God, everything is in my way, honey. I just want you to sit right and chat. Okay, I think we're better. So yes, honey, we are going to the gym. We're gonna get a workout in. I am really excited. I didn't go yesterday, but that's okay because today is a new day. I don't know why I'm talking in this little Southern accent. But it like comes and goes. See, I'm, now I'm back to me. But anyways, yeah, how are you? How's your day? What'd you do today? Leave a comment below if you need to declutter your closet, but you haven't done it. Or maybe you have done it. Um, because that was, it literally took me all day. I started, I think at like 10.30ish in the morning. And I'm literally, it's 6.49 and I'm heading to the gym now. And I probably finished like 20 minutes ago. So yeah, it took me all day. I was exhausted. I was like, heavens, where did all this clothing come from? And not to mention, I didn't even get the stuff in my drawers. But I just recently went through that. So I think we're fine on that note. I really hope this is not disgustingly like out of frame okay wow this is getting a little crazy this is getting a little crazy the man next door next door <laughs> the man driving next to me just saw me talking to my phone so he probably thinks I'm on FaceTime but I'm really talking to y'all on the YouTubes I'm just trying to be relatable okay I just want this vlog to be so much fun even if it's in my vehicle and I don't know if I'm looking in the right place and this man beside me is really trying to get over like you're gonna kill somebody if you keep driving like a maniac I don't understand what's wrong with people but anyways, we are almost at the gym, honey, and this man is driving like a looney tune. I need to get over. All right, we are at the gym. It is loaded, locked and loaded. The, you know, after work crowd is here and ready to get it in. So let's hope I find a parking space. <laughs> right let's lower this <laughs> anyways um i am back from the gym i'm about to go to kroger to get a couple of things um to make for lunch and dinner tomorrow and to get some kombucha because i love y'all i love kombucha like if they, if Kaveda ever wanted to sponsor me, I would be here for it. Okay, so I found the meatless sausage. Smart sausage. Meatless. Seems kind of expensive though, compared to a different store that I went to. And they don't have any on sale. This is so sad. Oh, the kombucha's right here. And there's not the kombucha that I like. Oh. Was, I don't understand. Okay. I will come back when I'm in the car 
after shopping. Hey guys, it's the next day. Um, I kind of left yesterday, like going to the gym. I didn't really, oh no, I kind of recorded a little bit at the grocery store. Um, and then I headed home, showered, and just went to bed. So I'm kind of starting late in the day. I'm going to run a few errands, then go to the gym, um, probably hang out at my aunt's house, go hang out with some cousins. And yeah, so I'll catch up with you. Um, so before I head out, I kind of need a little pick-me-up. So I'm going to try this um, Starbucks Caramel Macchiato. It's sweet and buttery, Hannah. It's sweet and buttery. So we're going to try that and see how that goes. And then I got this creamer. Oh, this is half and half. But I guess I could use it as creamer. Um, Dairy-free. Um vanilla flavored so gonna try that i don't even know if i need creamer for this but we're gonna see so let me go get a cup i got my cup oh my hands cut off can y'all see me hey okay so i got my cup and i'm gonna try well take this off let me shake it up a little bit make sure we get all of that sweet and buttery goodness mixed in nice um i'm gonna try a little bit i don't really think i need creamer honestly oh that's nice that is definitely nice for a little iced caramel macchiato if you are into iced uh coffee and don't really want to brew it. Oh, it says shake well and serve chilled over ice or warm up and serve hot. I might have to try it hot, but I don't know. I like it. I like iced coffee. So I guess I bought this for no reason because it doesn't need any creamer. Um, but yeah, so I got my coffee and we're about to go run some errands. So I'll catch you in the car. Hello, do we like this new angle? Honey, I found a random car mount in my car. I think it's my mom's, but we're gonna use it. I like this angle way better. You, like, you're not seeing my double chain on it. Oh, ooh, that was kind of close. But, oh my gosh, we can chat it up. Let's hope this doesn't fall. I'm not sure how secure this is, but we're gonna see, honey. I'm at the bank and the line is so long. But let's lower this radio kind of in my way. Um yeah, the line is like kind of long. I've been here for a couple minutes. So I was like, oh, let me clean out my inner console. And <laughs> thank God I did because look what I found. So now y'all get a better angle. And it's not gonna be as bumpy, hopefully. Um yeah, well, I gotta remember not to look at myself on the screen, but look at the camera. So I'm talking to y'all again. <sighs> this is crazy. Um, but yeah, do y'all want to see what was in my inner console? All the surprises that I found. Well, we found a box of tampons. Always keep those in there because sometimes, you know mother nature just surprises you and then you're walking around like <gasps> girl you got a tampon so if y'all ever see me in the streets and you need a tampon how at your girl because i have some in my car I'm just gonna clean out the middle a little bit it's a little gross down there it's disgusting i found a french fry oh like the makeup gurus a nice shade of french fry crusty yellow throw that away I keep a bag in my car for trash so that when I'm in you know long bank lines I can just clean out my car and I have a trash bag some hauls in there I don't know who was sick but I needed some cool fresh hauls these had some balloon holders from when I went to a little event for my sorority and we needed to hold down balloons so I bought some and then we never used them we just tied the balloons to a chair um, but I was like 
they're $1.29. We'll need them again sometime. So I'm gonna take those in the house when I get home and not leave my car. Oh, we're moving. I'm only one car behind. That's exciting. I'm just really excited that I found this car mount and I don't have to pay money to buy one. Um, I found some lotion, one, two lotions. This has been in my car for I don't know how long and there is, it's flat as I don't know what, but there's still lotion in there. And then when it gets really hot, it gets nice and oily. Oily, not oily, oily. And I just am smooth and buttery and sweet, just like my sweet buttery coffee. I'm so glad I got that. I wish it would stop giving me paper receipts. Because I'm trying to save all the trees I can. That's why I use a debit card. Okay? Even though cash is technically not uh, really paper. It's like a combination of materials. Oh my god. I just <gasps> love this car mount. I'm so Y'all don't even know. Because I was contemplating, like, should I buy one? Should I just keep it where it's at? But this angle is so much better. Like, I can move y'all. If I have a guest in the car, they can be in the video. This is just thrilling. Exciting. Um, but yeah. I feel like car vlogs are the easiest. Oh, it's shaking. Oh, no. It's a little rocky. I gotta figure out how to balance it to where it's not shaky when I drive. But okay, I'm headed to my aunt's house, so I will talk to y'all when I get there. Okay, bye. So I came to surprise, surprise. <laughs> Words are hard. Um, I came to surprise my aunt. She's not home. My cousins aren't home. My uncle isn't home. So it was a big fail. So, since they aren't home, I'm gonna go do a little shopping. So, yeah, plans have changed, but that's okay. Um, yeah, we're gonna go out. We're gonna go hit up Target. We're gonna go hit up Marshall. We're gonna go hit up Home Goods, cause that's fun. Um, but yeah, thanks for not being home, family. So I'll just have to show you them another day because they are just so precious and just darling. Clearly, they don't love me enough, though, to invite me out. It's kind of rude, but whatever. All right, y'all. I will talk to you later. I love TJ Maxx. I like these. I love these actually. And I like this boy. He's, he's Dolce Vita. Oh, and these are basically a dupe for like Hermes. Ooh, my socks in the way. But they're Steve Madden. And they're 30 bucks instead of like 300. So yeah. These are the sandal options. Whoo! Your girl did some shopping. It's really hot. Oh, getting a little bit glowing. But we're gonna do a um, car haul because those are so much fun. Um, I ended up going to TJ Maxx and Hobby Lobby. So I only got one thing from Hobby Lobby. Um, this bead set. I really just wanted the greens and the blues, but I guess the other colors were a bonus. And 
it ended up coming it was $13.99 and then I had a 40% off coupon that you can always get like online but I had it on the back of a receipt and so it ended up coming to like eight oh there's lighting oh honey come on um anyways it ended up coming to like eight and change so I got one two three four five six seven eight so essentially eight colors uh with three different sizes for eight bucks so not a bad deal and I plan on doing like a DIY project with this jacket um that I have and then I needed a hair blow dryer hair dryer blow dryer whatever you call it and they had this um chi tech but it's small it's travel size and it was only 28 bucks at um tj maxx originally 34.99 compared to 60 bucks i was like uh why not i've been i bought a diva curl diffuser but i didn't have a blow dryer so finally have a blow dryer so i can use it and try it out so that could be like another video idea and then I got this um, natural toothpaste. Somebody just pulled up next to me, so they're gonna see me talking to myself. Awkward. But it was on sale for $3. Um, so yeah, and I'm running low on toothpaste. And then I was getting a little hungry, which I actually need to eat, because I haven't eaten since breakfast. So I had these banana chips, and they are sriracha flavor. They're actually really good. So I just got out the gym and I just pulled into Target. So yeah, I'm gonna see what fun things I can find and then I'll haul it once I get back in the car. Okay, hey guys, I am back from Target and like I said I would, I'm doing a little car haul. So Pixie has this Glow O2 oxygen mask um, and it was on sale from $24 to $7.20. Can't really see it but yeah so i'm gonna try that out i've been really dying to try this native deodorant i've heard so many good things about this um it doesn't have any parabens or aluminum which is not very good um for deodorant it clogs pores and like i've been using bad deodorant for so long this is paraben free aluminum free and it's supposed to be better for you and not clog your pores like your armpit pores but yeah that was my target haul and i think i'm gonna end this vlog here i plan on going home showering 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 <laughs> words are hard um and i think i'm just i need to wash my hair i need to do a deep condition so i want to do that let's do a little self-care evening cap um <laughs> whoa i hate myself <laughs> um but yeah thanks again for tuning in um this is my first vlog i'm really excited and yeah tune in for more videos like comment 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 like comment wow i cannot talk like, comment, subscribe, tell your friends, tell your mom, tell your dad, tell your grandma. I mean, I know grandmas are on YouTube and sometimes they want to watch, you know, a girl do car vlogs, aka me. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> oh.